all right what is up guys so welcome to another episode we are fishing the first annual uh vinnie carrillo or vincent carrillo fluke and sea bass tournament uh it was 100 bucks to join uh best of fluke and sea bass for uh recreation commercial charter and dragger uh, draggers are on, are competing with like four other four other boats so we don't have to worry about them but um it's biggest fluke and biggest sea bass so we got a shot i got an eight pointer already this eight pointer jeez i'm thinking about bow season eight pounder um already this season so i mean it could happen it's been a little slow of a bite this year so um i did get a t-shirt out of it so worst case scenario i got a hundred dollar t-shirt <laughs> So if you like this video, uh, smash that subscribe button, please. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you guys think. So we're gonna be using the St. Croix seven foot Mojo Inshore, uh, medium power, fast action, uh, Dio BG 3000, 15 pound braid to a 20 pound fluorocarbon leader, pink and white funky bucktail. Uh, I think it's like a one and a half ounce funky bucktail. I'm gonna pair this bucktail with a nice five inch swimming mullet. I'm gonna leave it right there in the juice. Just like that. Let it marinate. Let that gulp juice get all in the hair and stuff. All right, here we go, first drop. Let's check our drags. Way too loose. Perfect. All right, let's go. All right, guys, so we had a westerly wind against the incoming tide, the early stage of the incoming tide. So the drift conditions were a little tough, but uh, they wind up picking up a little bit as the tide picks up. Ready to send it? Yes. Okay, it's sent. Oh, he's just shy. <laughs> Look at that, he's a quarter inch shy. See you next year. Alright, well that's a good sign. Fluke bite here. Little guy. Well, this is promising. A couple solid hits. Let's get back down because we still have some time on this drift. out last weekend didn't catch a single fluke caught a couple sea bass and the weather turned kind of crappy had to bail so this is a good sign that we got a couple fluke already one was close to being a keeper
back on it. We'll see, bass. Jesus. Well, acrobat. Sea bass. No, it's a sea robin. Oh, it's a sea bass. All right. He's obviously going back. Ted bit too small. We're looking for a pretty large sea bass. Not the size we're looking for. Right species, wrong size. I think we're gonna go make a move. I don't wanna burn all of our time on one spot. So we're gonna do a little exploring. <laughs> nah, a couple shorties and that's it. All right. Yeah. All, All right, thanks guys. See you later. All right, guys. So as you can tell in some of my previous videos, the Coast Guard's out here checking kayakers and um, stand-up paddle boards pretretty frequently. So just make sure you have all your safety gear, like life jacket, uh, whistles, flags, um, radio, VHF radio, and uh, flares if you're fishing at night. Nice little sea bass. All right guys, so the exploring didn't really help out too much. Uh, we didn't really find too many quality fish. Mostly pretty much all short fish, but uh, we gave it a valiant effort. So we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button, leave a comment, and uh, hit that like button too.